Imagine this. A mountaineer, high on a rugged terrain, falls victim to a sudden avalanche. The terrain is treacherous, the weather is hostile, and the only feasible way to reach the victim is from the air. This is a situation where helicopter evacuation becomes the only viable option. First, the emergency control center receives the distress call. The details of the victim's location and condition are crucial and need to be communicated with utmost clarity. The rescue team then gathers this information, strategizes, and forms an action plan. Picture the helicopter, a shining beacon of hope in the stormy skies, swooping in to rescue the stranded adventurer. So how does this daunting task unfold? Here's a step-by-step -step walkthrough. Next, the helicopter, equipped with the necessary rescue gear, is readied for departure. The pilot, along with the rescue crew, takes off towards the reported location. They rely on advanced navigation systems to guide them through the hazardous terrain. Upon reaching the scene, the helicopter hovers above the victim. The crew assesses the situation from above, deciding the best approach to secure the victim. They take into account the victim's condition, the terrain, and the weather. Now here comes the most critical part, the actual rescue. A crew member attached to a winch cable is lowered down to the victim. This crew member, often a trained paramedic, provides immediate medical aid if needed. The victim is then secured in a rescue basket or harness and prepped for extraction. The crew member signals the helicopter once the victim is secure. The winch operator then carefully reels them back up. This process requires precision, strength, and above all, teamwork. Once aboard, the victim receives further medical attention if necessary while the helicopter heads back to the base. Upon landing, an ambulance or medical team is ready to take over, ensuring the victim gets the best possible care. This process, while complex, is methodically carried out by the trained professionals in the rescue team. They navigate through hazardous terrains and adverse weather conditions, all in the interest of saving lives. In summary, a helicopter evacuation in hazardous terrain involves a systematic process. It begins with receiving the distress call and strategizing the rescue plan. The helicopter then takes off, locates the victim, and assesses the situation. The critical rescue phase involves lowering a crew member to the victim and reeling them back up. Once back at the base, the victim is handed over to medical professionals for further care. Understanding this process helps appreciate the tremendous effort and risk involved in such rescue missions. It underscores the importance of advanced technology, skilled professionals, and seamless teamwork in emergency response operations. So the next time you hear the distant thump of helicopter blades, remember the life-saving mission it could be on and the brave crew navigating through danger to bring someone to safety.